the establishment is in the hands of people who believe that india can develop only through the model of the west that means we have to examine what the western model is now all of us know west means america because even in america even in the west even though european countries are western countries america is the model even for the european countries and many of our people want to go to america settle in america take a job in america maybe even would like to become citizens of america this you can see from the thousands of people who stand in queue outside the us consulate to get a visa to enter the united states this shows united states attracts everybody so naturally that which is so important in the mind of the people should be examined all of us are made to believe and we believe not only we believe we also sometimes talk america is the most powerful economy in the world it is militarily the most powerful country and it is virtually a one point reference for the world today this is how america is projected intellectually powerful it runs the most efficient government the best market system in the world everything one point reference is america this blind imitation of america is now guiding the world in fact globalization is very nearly equivalent to americanization that is why we have to understand this american myth how many of us know i mean i am saying us it is not only people here how many experts in this country know how many bureaucrats know how many journalists know how many politicians know america is not the richest country in the world it is the most borrowed nation in the world the amount of borrowing which america has made if you total that borrowing and keep it on the one side and the borrowings of all other nations or added and kept on the other side the amount of money america has borrowed is at least 20 times more than the amount of money all other nations have borrowed the borrowing america has made is in american currency in american terminology 5.5 trillion dollars many people do not know what is a trillion some do not even know what is a billion i will translate it in indian rupees the amount of money america has borrowed if it is translated into indian rupees it is 275000 crore crores you can understand what it is it is not that they have borrowed and stopped borrowing they are borrowing every day in fact there is one name in america alan greenspan this alan greenspan has emerged as a cult figure he makes a statement once in 3 months and what statement he makes the entire world is looking at the television to find out what statement this man is going to make and he said in september that if america has to survive every day america has to borrow 10000 crores from other countries every day 10000 crores if america cannot borrow this money the american economy will have to close down this is his statement why america is borrowing this money all of us know in 1991 we had a problem what was that problem the foreign exchange crisis we just did not have foreign exchange at all in fact next month's imports we couldn't pay we had to pledge our gold to get some money just like a householder pledging the jewel of his wife 
you can understand what was the what could be the state of that family that was the state of the indian economy the indian nation in 1991 when we had to pledge our gold to get some money to pay for imports our imports were more than the exports but it is not by a huge margin but you know what is america's imports as compared to their exports every year america's imports exceed their exports by 440 billion dollars 440 billion dollars it is approximately 34 lakh crores their imports are more than the exports and if you import more and export less you have to pay for it for which they don't have the money who gives them the money there are countries which lend money to america japan is the country which is lending the maximum to america they have lent something like 3 trillion dollars which is 1 lakh 50 uh, uh, 150 lakh crore crores is the amount which japan has lent to america many people can ask this question why japan is lending to america how japan is able to lend to america i will come to it after saying who are the other people who are lending money to america china is lending money to america they have lent 300 billion dollars which is 15 lakh crores i am giving approximate figures 15 lakh crores is the amount which china has lent to america i am going to give you a surprise information many of us are made to believe that india cannot run without america the american investment is needed without american investment india cannot survive so we need american investment and for that we will do anything your newspapers will glorify america your government will do whatever america wants so that you will get american investment from 1991 to 2001 if you total all the investments that have come from america it is 15 billion dollars 15 billion dollars approximately 45000 crores you can take it but you know what is the amount of money india has lent to america india lending to america we can't believe india has lent to america 65 billion dollars today if you take the balance in today's balance sheet every day it is increasing but today india has lent to america 65 billion dollars approximately you can say it is equal to 3 lakh 25000 crores india has lent to america ministers in india are not aware of this most newspapers do not know about it many economists business people do not know about it i have addressed corporate meetings captains when i told them this they were stunned because they do not know when you say your foreign exchange reserve has gone up to 70 billion dollars you don't keep the foreign exchange in lock and key you invest in american securities it is like you are purchasing government of india bonds when you purchase government of india bonds it is an asset for you it is a property for you it is an investment for you but for the government of india it is a loan the government has borrowed money from you likewise when india invests in american bonds it is an investment for india but for america it is a liability it is a loan how many people know that india has invested in america four times the amount america has invested in india not only that the american investment in india is in the form of factories in the form of buildings but india's investment in america is money spent and gone 